In this video tutorial, I'm going to share to you on how I can fix keyboard typing backward issue. So let's get started. Click on the start button, click on the settings icon. Click on system on the left pane, scroll down and click on troubleshoot, click on other troubleshooters. Then here if you can find the keyboard with the run button corresponding to it. So if this is the keyboard with the run button corresponding to it, run the keyboard troubleshooter. Now what that will do is that that will help you detect and spot the issue or problem that you are facing on your windows. And aside from that, that will also give you suggestions and recommendations on how you can fix the issue and will also automatically fix the issue for you. So simply run the troubleshooter. Okay, so if this video is valuable, do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel so that we can produce more videos and tutorials for you. Next method is we have to use combination keys. So let me open the on-screen keyboard. Use the combination keys like control plus shift plus caps lock key control plus the left shift and the caps lock key okay and then another combination is that you have to click on control shift control shift and then the caps lock key control right shift and the caps lock key so the first combination is control left shift and the cups lucky then control right shift and the cups lucky okay so try on that next method is we have to right click at the start button select device manager once you open a device manager window locate keyboards and expand the list Locate your keyboard driver, make a right click, select update driver, search automatically for drivers. Now the best drivers for your device are already installed, close this. Next method in the same device manager window, locate your keyboard driver, make a right click, select uninstall device, click on the uninstall button. Once uninstalled, restart your Windows once, right click at the start button, shut down or sign out and restart. After restarting, that will automatically reinstall the driver that you have uninstalled from your Windows. Then go ahead in the window search bar, type control, panel, click on it under the best match. View this into small icons and in here you have to look for region, click on region. Then click on additional settings. I mean like you have to go to the administrative tab, okay? Again click on region, then click on the administrative tab click on change system local so here simply change your uh system local into your current system local okay change this to your current system local then click on okay apply and then okay and then close this then we can also perform a clean boot so go ahead and do in the search bar type ms config click system configuration under the best match click on the services tab Check this option, hide all Microsoft services, disable all, apply, and then OK, and click on the restart button if the restart button will appear. So that's it. So again, do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel. Thank you for watching.